Hello everyone, this is Jeanette again. I wanted to upload another quick video for you this evening. I'm actually not feeling well today, so I wanted to get the three videos that I made today uploaded before I decided to turn in for the night. And this was the third card that I came up with this uh, today. This is just a simple I miss you card. Uh, this was um, you made using the Accent Essentials cartridge. I am trying to use some of the cartridges that I never really, really use, and this is one of them. So what I did was cut um, on page 79. You see the scallop frame. Well, I cut this on blackout. Let me adjust this a little bit. I cut this on blackout, and my base layer, which is this layer right here, I cut it at seven and a half inches. Then I cut it again and that is this layer and I cut this one at five and a half inches and then I cut the scallop which is on page it's towards the front here somewhere let me see if I can find it really quickly for you um, a lot of ways that I uh, find out where the, the images are I go ahead and I look on the back of my box and I know that scallop is right up in this area so let me see if I can find that really quickly okay so that is this scallop that is here on page 47 and I cut that scallop at four and a half inches and I cut it in black after my pieces were cut I took them and this is what that piece looked like um, after it was cut out. So I went ahead and I um, folded it and um, using my bone folder. Then I took the other piece which is this one right here and I cut it in half and I adhered that to here. I inked both of these with a, a black ink that was um, one of my um, stays on ink pad and just to give so this would stand out a little bit more and so there'd be a little bit more black to match the scallop then I adhered the scallop using my zig two-way glue stick and adhered that to the front of the card um, I like to layer flowers, so I went ahead and layered a lot of flowers. Uh, the white flower was a little thin, so I went ahead and did a double layer of the white. Then a pink, down here is a brown, and then another white. I had found these little butterfly brads at Target a long time ago, so I went ahead and stuck that to the center of the flower. I pop dotted the flower. Then just to give it a little bit of bling, I added the three little blingy dots up at the top. And then using a stamp set, most of my stamp sets I buy when they're on clearance. And this is one of them. The only thing that I'm going to have to get in the habit of doing is actually labeling what the name of these stamp sets are. But this is just a sediments one. And I used the I Miss You. And I inked that when my brown stays on. And just stamped it here at the bottom. And that was my quick card, my third quick card for today. Thank you for joining me. I would love to see you post some comments or rate this video. And thank you for stopping in, and I hope to see you again. Please drop in at my blog at www.scrapbookmomscorner.blogspot.com. And until next time, uh, have a happy evening. Bye.